Okay, welcome back everybody. Here I am after verifying my email address with Google. This is a second tutorial on Google PPC. Um, and after you've verified, you go to your email and click on the email. You get this screen. It says email address verified. And then you just click here to continue. And here we are at the new Google AdWord interface. Okay, so what we're going to do first, um, you're going to have to pay five dollars to get started with Google. And before you do that, you actually create an advertisement. So don't worry too much about that, the first advertisement, because you can always pause it or go and go in and change it at any time. We're just going to kind of get this up there so that we can, f you know, finish off with getting the account registered and then you can go back and change it. So here we are, create your first campaign. And we'll hit this. Okay, tell us about your business. This, you know what, we don't need to do all of this. Do you offer more than one product or service? These are some questions. Um, you know, you can click on these and see their advice. Right now I'm just gonna skip this step. Okay, campaign name. Here you want to make it um, relevant instead of just leaving it as campaign one. You want to kind of have an idea because you might be creating lots of different campaigns. So kind of make it relevant to what you're kind of going to be targeting. Make it something rather general and then within each campaign you will have specific keyword phrases um, and you can call the AdWord groups differently. Um, so just to give you an example, I'm in network marketing, so I will put network marketing. This is very general. And then within that, you can put home business. You can put something, just keep it rather general, but just enough so that you know what it, you're talking about here. Um, now this is debatable what you want to do with this. It kind of depends on your market and your business. Um, you can just do United States, Canada. I'm going to leave it for that right now. Um, if you are in network marketing, good countries to target in network marketing are US, Canada, the UK, Australia, New Zealand, and I think that's, I think I got them all. Those are the best ones. Um, so you can go in there and change that um, here. You can just put select one or more locations, then that allows you to go in and change, you know, and add those countries. I'm just going to leave it as United States, Canada for right now. Okay, what languages do your customers speak? English, I would assume here. Um, let's see, just leave this as it is. Bidding options. Um, let's put, we're not going to put automatic right now. We're going to put manual bid, bidding. And you want to put an amount per day. Now, you know, this will vary. I would say put you know you can put five dollars if you have that if you want to be spending that much a day put three dollars if you want to spend that much a day um, you can get quite a few clicks if you do it right for five dollars a day or even three dollars a day and I will show you exactly how you can get really a lot of clicks for an amount of money at, you know not go broke with Google AdWords which I know has happened <laughs> to quite a few people so we're gonna hit save and continue and go on. Okay, and here you are and you create a headline. And now I'm gonna go into detail about exactly what you wanna write on these. So don't look at this now. I'm just gonna write um, something right now. And this is what you should do too because we're gonna pause this and then we will go into do a whole tutorial on how to do this right. Um, are you struggling? All caps. Okay. So just really quickly, and again, we're going to go into detail on this, but put it all in caps, all the letters in caps. Um, then here you will put, this is what's going to come up on the ad display. That means this is the, the 
URL that's going to show. So you can put, I'll just put my blog here, one of them anyway. Okay, and then here though, you have to put the actual destination. So for example, my this is not the actual destination of my MLM Advantage blog. Um, I have that domain name forwarded to my blog, so you will have to go in if you don't, if that isn't the same destination, if you have your domain forwarded as well, you have to actually go in and get the real, mine is on Blogger, this blog, so you will have to get the real URL and put it in there. Google will not allow you to put something else, so make sure that this is, this is the real URL, and it could be the same, you know, if you have the exact same address as when the destination is exactly the same, it will be the same. But if you're forwarding a domain, it will not. So put that there. And you want to take away this because it's already here. So we'll just put this. Okay, I just took away the HTTP colon and forward slash forward slash because they already have it here. And then I'm going to stop this here because we're going to get into the keyword part next and that's really important. So let me stop this here and I'll see you on the next tutorial.